Hello guys, in today's video I'm gonna show you how to fix Ubisoft Connect connection lost. Uh, this tutorial will be quick and simple, just make sure to subscribe to this channel and leave a like on this video if you will find this guide useful. Now, first things first, you want to go ahead to your device manager, open it up, and on device manager you want to go ahead and find network adapters right there. Go ahead, open them up, and you want to go ahead and update the drivers to all of them. So basically just search for the drivers and update them if there will be any. And that's pretty much it what you can do here. Uh, another thing would be to go to Ubisoft Connect, then go on your profile and go to settings. And after that, be on general and click change proxy settings. After that, this will open up and you want to be on uh, connections and LAN settings. Click on it. After that, this will pop up. You want to make sure that both of these automatically detect settings and use automatic configuration script would be turned on. And after that, you also want to click on use a proxy server for your LAN. And if there will be any numbers here, you want to click on advanced and delete all of them and then click OK. Now, after you have changed and saved all of the changes, you want to go and search and run um, uh, enter CMD. And once you will see it, right click on it and click run as administrator. Now, after that, this will open up. And now you will need to enter uh, like four commands. So first thing would be to enter IP config, uh, then space slash flush DNS and click enter. Uh, after every single step, you want to click enter. Um, now you want to enter another one would be IP config uh, space slash release. I'm not going to enter, uh, click enter because it will show my IP, but basically you need to write down release. Another one would be to en uh, enter IP config uh, space slash renew. And after that, you want to enter the last one. The last to enter would be NETSH netch space ENT space IP uh, space reset and after that you're gonna reset this and it should fix your problem please restart your computer and see if the problem persists or not if your problem is still there you want to disable your proxy so you want to enter proxy settings on your search bar open it up and after that you will see um, here proxy settings and then manual proxy setup click on it mine is already disabled so i don't need to do anything actually so that's pretty much it again you can go go and restart your computer and see if the problem uh, was changed now uh, one of the last things you want to do is go ahead to your um, network settings on your computer and then you're going to choose uh, your connection to Wi-Fi, Ethernet, whatever you're using. I'm using Wi-Fi, so just go to your Wi-Fi. Then click on Hardware Properties. And here on Hardware Properties, you're going to click uh, More Adapter Options right there, Edit. And here you will see Internet Protocol version 4. Click on it, then click Properties, and then you're going to see that you can uh, use the following DNS server ad addresses, and you want to go ahead and write down some type of um, DNS addresses, I'm just going to use Google once 8.8.8 and 8.8.4.4. Uh, and then you're going to click OK and save it. Now restart your computer and see if the problem fi uh, was fixed. And the last thing you can do is reset your internet connection. So on settings, on network and internet, you want to go to advanced network settings. Here you're going to scroll down until you see network reset. Click on it. And here you can reset it now. If you are using Wi-Fi, then you will need to enter password again. And that should fix your problem. If this video was helpful, make sure to subscribe and I will see you next time. Bye.